hello welcome or welcome back to my channel this is amanda otherwise known as the tangle skeins crafted uh, today i just have a small temu unboxing unbagging for you all um, these are things i bought um, i'm not showing you everything i bought excuse the squeaking of the chair because some of the stuff is for like my car i just got a car so i got like some little hooks to go on the seats and and cleaner stuff and whatnot anyway this is my diamond painting related content so I mean nothing exciting here but I get these I use these a lot which I'm doing the little hearts this time I've been I've got the circles which were less nice and less sticky than the squares or the rectangles for some reason I don't know if I got them from a different company or what but like I said I use these a lot more than I thought I was going to of course, I'm diamond painting a lot more than I was, too. Anyway, grabbed a couple more of those. They were less than $2 for a package, which has, I think, four sheets in a package. Numbers 1 through 99, letters, and then all the DMC codes. I have some right here already open. There's the rectangle ones. And the circle ones. And they go all the way up. 3866 in the DMC codes. And most of the colors match pretty good, the drills. But every once in a while I get one that's just it's kind of off. And I don't know if it's the drill or the sticker. I don't have a way to compare yet. Eventually I have enough drills that I can compare the colors between the same numbers. So this, I already looked and it is discontinued. <laughs> Oh, like that seems to happen a lot on Tamu. But this, I got like a surprise or a mystery six pack of small diamond paintings. I've been doing some of the larger ones lately, and I thought it'd be nice to have some small ones I could just, you know, just do real quick. I don't know if I'm going to do them on camera or off camera, but oh, I thought they'd be cute. They were mystery, but I'd seen other people open some, and they're usually pretty cute. I'm going to rattle now. I will try to mute that so that it's not overly loud. Um, I will put on screen how much I paid for it. Just gonna look real quick, see if I can see. Looks like it doesn't show me. What does it not show? There it is. Order information. All right, six piece mysterious diamond paintings, so eight forty eight. And I figured eight forty eight was not a bad price for six. And then I actually got refunded because you know um, Tamu will refund the amount of the difference if um, a thing goes on sale. Sorry about that. During the um, thirty days after you buy it, so I actually got a refund of a dollar twenty three on that. I actually paid like seven twenty-five for six. I'm gonna have to re-record this part. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Which to you that was a blink. To me, it was a little while while my daughter. She's not having a meltdown or anything, but she's having a really bad day at college today. So <laughs> she needed me. All right. So I can't remember what I was saying. I know I said that I've got a partially re partial refund on these and some of the other items that was in the order because you know if the price changes and goes down within 30 days after you order it then um, they refund you the difference which is really nice and helps keep me buying things honestly because I, I get enough that it it feels like it's I don't know maybe it's girl math but I almost feel like some of my stuff's free because I get so many refunds here and there but I'm sure it doesn't add up to that way and the cat's trying to come visit if you hear jingling or anything. So anyway, let's check out these tiny little 20 by 20s. Let's start with this one. Looks like a Pegasus. It's going to be rattling. I 
I have no idea how good the quality of these are going to be. I don't do the tiny ones. But I thought it'd be really fun to have just some of the tiny ones to do because they're not going to take me long. I'd probably do one in a couple hours. Some of the sections of my bigger ones take me like three hours to record. Alright. I never paid attention to how long it took me to do things until I started recording. So there's 13 colors. I don't know how well you can see it. 13 colors. I mean, it's printed well. It's pretty clear. You can see all of them. It's just letters. I think the most difficult part would be the R and the B, telling those apart if they're side by side. That's not too bad. As long as you got good lighting, because there's an R and a B right here, and like I said, you're not going to be able to see. But of course, the B is a little bit darker. I said, of course, like you would know what the colors are. How big are these actually? I'm assuming the 20 by 20 is the canvas. Yeah, the, it's not, the canvas isn't even 20. Alright, so the image itself is, let's look here on zero, 15. 15 centimeters. By 15 centimeters. What is that inches? So 6 by 6. 9 by 9 centimeters, 6 by 6 inches. I'm glad the drills come packaged with each little diamond painting because I, I watched someone open. Um, like a package of several like mystery kits and all of the drills were put together so you had to separate the drills out and figure out which kit they went with I think that would be quite annoying let's look let's see They don't have color codes on them, just the number. So this is one, two, one, three, and ten, and then this is eleven, twelve, and thirteen. That's almost like a minty green. My lighting is just horrible. Oh, uh, light, really light lavender, or. Maybe a purple pink. So I don't have any trails in them. I think I like this one because I love purples and there's lots of purples in this. Oh, it's like lavenders, purples, and bluish. Blue violets. Some deep, I think, dark blue. No black, no 310. Some reason that always makes me happy. I think it's because I've worked with so many things that have a lot of black, both cross stitch and diamond painting. Let's put this to the side. It comes with the normal little kit with the wax, the tray, and the little single placer pen. This one's been staring at me. Let's look at this one. The adhesive on the packaging is really good. Got random little needles just laying there. Okay. Oh, this one's longer. This one's 20 by 30. I love owls. I don't know if there's anyone else out there that watches me that loves owls, but are they just not? They're like majestic and cute at the same time. Look at the big eyes. 
Oh, this one's cute. This one's probably going to go up on my wall or on my desk. I have an enclosed desk. <laughs> so I have like walls in my desk that I put my artwork and stuff up on. Alright, 15 colors. 20 by 30. Which I'm assuming is going to be. Oh, I don't want to assume anything. I have 15. Did I say 9 earlier? Anyway, I'm losing my mind. 15. By about 25 centimeters. Don't you love my little. My little, um, what are they called? Cover keepers? It's one of those little free things I got from Tame Air that, like, you play the games and every once in a while you just, they'll send you a random free gift. This is one of them. And then I also have a diamond painting coming that they, this I chose, the diamond painting, they just chose for me. It was random. Anyway. It's so small that I think 15 collars is gonna do well with this. I mean, it's not, it's a cutesy kind of Owl and it, it doesn't have a whole lot of colors in it. The same little kit, wax tray in the pin. I'm not boring you to tears with this. I'm feeling very rambly today, yet I keep having moments of just quiet. Partly because I want to be able to mute or at least turn down the sound of the rattling. It has the, the kit name and the number on it, but no like DMC codes or anything. One through fifteen. On my camera, on my screen, it's showing almost like a burgundy or amber, but to my eyes, it looks brown. Grays. The orangey brown. I always want to say terracotta, but I think terracotta is a different color. It's a greenish, it has a purple, because I love purple, so yay. Kind of a mustardy yellow. Another brown, more gray. Maybe a black. And some light blues, teals. It's going to be really cute, I think. This does not have 310, but it's got 939, that's probably what I was looking at. Which is, what, a really deep navy, maybe? It is all letters. Nothing confusing. It's pretty clearly. It's got good stick to it, so it's sticky enough. Okay, I, there's something I was working on that the drills keep popping off of, and I don't know if it's because it's not sticky enough or because I'm not lining them up well. I'm not sure. Anyway, that was the second one. I hope you want to see all of these, but if not, I understand if you drop out. You see one of the pretty ones and one of the cute ones. There we go. I was throwing the plastic off the cover off instead of the wrapping. This is another 20 by 30. I'm not going to measure this one since I measured the other one and it looks like it's the same. This one looks like a roaring lion in flames. I'd be roaring too if I was in flames. So it's going to have a lot of dark, well, dark background and then lots of fire colors, flame colors. 
red, some yellows, maybe some oranges. 15 colors. 20 by 30 centimeters. Came with the little kit. Keep forgetting to make sure I'm on, on camera whenever I show you stuff. Pen, tray, no wax. first one had the kit name on it too, they're just different, printed differently. Alright, so one, so two of the three tins, so this one definitely has some black in it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ten, eleven, 12, 13, 14, 15. So yeah, just number one, the black is the only one that has more than one thing of drills. Now that this routing is so loud. I said reds and oranges and yellows. That one's like this. Brown. Get like that almost reddish brown. It's not quite like a burgundy or, or a mahogany. Almost. My brain's like trying to come up with a word that it's not working. A little cream color. Browns. I always end up with those random drills in with the colors. Yeah, I have no idea when I'll get to, around to doing some of these, but these smaller ones are going to be a nice break, I think. Especially, I hope they turn out kind of cute. One of the smaller, not small like this, but one of the smaller ones I'm working on is actually turning out a lot better than I thought it would for it being so small. So I have hopes for these. Here's another 20 by 20. It is a cow and sunglasses, which is kind of funny to me. I grew up around cows. Cows kind of make me happy. They make me think of home. Never seen one in sunglasses, though. It's got 13 colors. 20 by 20 centimeters. Some of these are really wrinkled up. Hopefully it don't affect painting them later. The regular kit with the wax, the tray, and the pin. Yeah, it's just as sticky as the other one. This one's going to have blues. Sorry, I can't figure out how to open this one for some reason. There it is. I try to hold it away from the microphone a little bit, but it doesn't seem to help any. 11 through 13. Green, I think that's in the sunglasses. And one through ten. I feel like this color, I haven't checked to see if they're the same, but I feel like this color keeps coming up. It's that kind of a reddish brown. And some tans. And the teals. I'm not sure what you call that. Almost a really light olive green. Kind of a green gray. Brown, 
light blue, dark green cream, hey crew. Ninety-nine. That's that really dark one. I love this greenish, tealish color. Of course, green. This is gonna be one of the cute ones, I think. I will do all of these. I don't know if I will keep them all or what I'm gonna do with them, but I will do all of them. I think they're cute. It's like I said, they're tiny. It's going to be fun just to have a quick, easy little kit to work on. Two more. Looks like another lion. Another 20 by 30. This one, he's stalking or you know walking majestically towards the the person the viewer he's gonna be colorful 20 by 30 15 colors comes with the typical kit Waxing pen. I need to get in frame. I mean, honestly, I, I love lions, but this isn't one I would normally choose, but it would probably turn out pretty cute. 15 colors. So we have. Quite a bit number one, one five four. Not much two. Three the purple. Four. There's no three ten. No nine three nine. Eight two three, I guess is the dark one. Which is number ten. Wait, did I look at that wrong? Nine, it's number nine. So it's that deep. My lights hit and it almost looks like a deep purple. The blues. I have no idea what color to call that. It's like a deep reddish pink, brownish pink, bright pink, bright green, brown, and mustardy yellow. But the darker one. That what looks like dark purple to me. The light blue, almost like is it aquamarine? Light purple, another orangey yellow. There's a bright yellow, light tan. There's a bright purple, gray, and then whatever color one five four is. So you're gonna have colorful areas on a dark background. I'll try to find a way to put pictures up for each of these, but if I cannot find them online, like, because it's discontinued, so nothing's popping up, plus it was a mystery, so I don't know if there's a way to put up the actual pictures. I'd have to, like, try to take a picture of this and then crop it and try to zoom in, I think it would just end up really blurry. You can't, like, in, from what I'm seeing on screen, you can't see the colors, but, I mean, it's similar to what it looks like right there in the picture. So I guess the purples are, you know, going to be purple, the yellows be yellow, and so on, and pink. Yeah. At the very least, it'll be interesting. It might turn out really pretty. I'm not sure. Alright, if you've hung in this long, Thank you so much. I have one more. Looks like it's going to be adorable. It's another 20 by 30. Sorry. Just leaving you with some dead air again. I'll try to open it.
Oh, look at him. This is like a Christmas puppy. He's got a little golden bell around his neck. And he is adorable. 20 by 30, 15 colors. Same as the rest, it's all letters for the symbols. And they're printed clearly. I always assume as much since it's all from the same company. Got a good stick to it. Oh, he's really cute. Look at those eyes. I love puppies. We don't have puppies. We just have cats. Someday, when we have our own place, we will have puppies. Probably not one as cute as this, though. Look how adorable he is. Alright, let's look at the colors. Here's the kit. Tray, wax. Okay. No double, so it's one package per color. That pink, one fifty two, one fifty four, three cans. So we do have black in this one. Looks like part of the background. Mm. Every time I say mustard yellow but dark, people are probably yelling at me. It is not mustard yellow. Sounds like a Dijon. It's like an orangey browny yellow. Dark green. Pans. Got deep reddish. Deep red and a brick red. Green. That weird pinky beige. No idea how to explain that color. Pink. The real light, almost a peach. Kind of brown. I hope you could see all of those and hear over the rattling. So, my favorite is probably either the puppy. Or the owl, I think. Kind of wish I hadn't got two lions, just because it was fun getting a variety of stuff. But I mean, it's two different kind of lions. And the cow. Maybe the pegasus. I was going to say, I think Cal might be one of my favorites, but I can't get them all in screen the way I have them. But the puppy and the owl definitely are going to be two of my favorites of these. And like I said, for, I think I paid $7.25 or something like that for all six. I think it's worth it. And a dollar something a kit. Dollar and some change. Not a bad deal. Anyway, that's my small, messy, rambly painting hall, diamond painting hall. Like I said, I got some other things, but I figured you wouldn't want to see like my nail decals and nail polish remover and random things I got for the car, so I left those out. Thank you so much. If you watched all the way to here, you are very special to me, because <laughs> I am one of those people who watch all the way to the credits, all the way to the thank you, and it's just... So, I always hope people will do the same for me, even though I ramble. Um, I appreciate you spending time with me. I appreciate you watching me unbag these. Um, let me know in the comments, which is your favorite? Which would you do? 
Because that puppy is just calling to me. I might have to do that in amongst all my Christmas stuff. Which I have a lot of stuff planned, so I don't know what how I'm going to get to everything that I want to do for Christmas. but Or for December, I should say. Anyway, thank you again. Um, please consider sharing this with someone you might think might think yeah that you think might like my channel like my content um please like the video if you enjoyed it at all if you haven't already please subscribe all the things help me so much on youtube to get me out there to people that want to see my content um plus it just makes me smile i see a like pop up and it just makes me happy because i feel like you know there's someone out there that actually likes some of the things that i I put out there, which is things I like, so I feel like we share something. Alright, I will end this. I thank you so much. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.